In this part, I'm going to explain how we can make a symbol. And after that, we are going to do a parameter simulation using the symbol we have made. So first, I'm going to open new schematic and call it matching number one, maybe. And OK. I'm going to use my previous matching. So uh, we have to go to uh, SPRLC and as actually SP match. Sorry. So if you remember, we made this circuit. We want to make exactly the same circuit, but we use a symbol. So I'm going to pick this actually two here and uh, I'm, I will uh, make my symbol and control C, control V here. So I want to uh, use this circuit and make it a symbol. What should I do? I have to use pins. As you see here, this is my pin, it says insert pin. So I'm going to use this pin here at the input. And also I have output pin like this. So I'm going to put my pin. Now my circuit is ready. But uh, actually don't forget this. If you want to use the, uh, for example, use a param variable here, you have to define variables inside this symbol. So now uh, I have to save this and I can use this as a block. What should I do? I should go to window and after the symbol. And the name of symbol should be matching one. And as you see here, you can uh, choose the shape of your symbol. You can uh, choose one of these here, as you see. Uh, maybe you can choose a device, for example. You can choose a different kind of things. It's uh, it's your it's optional actually. I'm going to choose a box. I think box is better here, as you see, auto generate. And here I can it can shows that I can put an input like one, three, five, seven, or the you know it means the the odds at the left size and even at the right size, or it's like this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So different kind of actually uh, orientations you can use this uh, here, and you can change everything. The shape, for example, the shape is correct. Welcome to Rah RF two hundred nine L Keysight Advanced Design System ADS Basics and Applications course, where you will learn how to do simulations on RF circuits in order to become an experienced radio frequency design engineer and landing a job in companies like Apple, SpaceX. Qualcomm and Broadcom and designing ICs going inside phones and laptops or systems going into satellite and planes. My name is Atasar Rafinejad and with my colleague and course advisor Asan Goncha I would be leading you through this course. I began my career as a research assistant during my PhD studies. Later on I moved from academia to industry as an RF and analog design engineer designing power amplifiers and low noise amplifier ICs. My course advisor Asan Gonche has more than five years RF design and test experience in the industry working at top semiconductor companies such as Broadcom and Qualcomm designing RF filter and bringing up of modules going to lastest phones, laptops and other consumer electronics. The ideal student for this course is an electrical engineer, computer science student planning to become an expert in RF and land a job in the RF field or engineers and employees of the communication and radio frequency related companies who want to boost up or refresh their knowledge on the topics. In this course, you are going to be provided with one month free trial ADS so you can do your own simulations. And besides that, you will have 180 nanometer technology PDK so you will have your own transistor models. And we are going to start with a simple uh, simulations like DC, AC as parameter and later on we will go on uh, uh, harmonic balance, uh, P1 dB, IP3 simulations, matching, optimization and different kind of things that you need to know about the ADS.